right, just finished these up for Jimmy Felcher, Juicy Jimmy Felcher. Set of wrist guards, gauntlets, whatever you want to call them. Uh, mostly leather, vinyl. Uh, this is a vinyl, but it's a little bit different kind. Um, I didn't have this in this kind of material, but it's pretty similar. Gives a good contrast. I want to use a neon green thread anyway. So, got a nice neon green thread around. Got the metal eyelets in them. This cool looking pink purple iridescent material that I found at a theater shop. And you can get it online too. Full leather back. This had a little discoloration right there from something, um, which is why I just used it for the back, because you won't see that. There's nothing wrong with the material. Um, I think I just stained it with something. I'm not sure what, though. Or I took heat to it. It might have been a defect in the material, too, because um, I bought a bunch of this in bulk, and some of it had uh, discoloration when they dyed it. So I think that's what it is, but you won't see that anyway. A couple little imperfections never hurt. And this one here, lettering. The green around it. I think the green thread really makes it pop. I like it a lot. The shock on it. Uh, these have more sentimental meaning. Uh, the shock is for a guy who, um, these are for a guy and his trainer wrestled as um, Chic Aftershock or Aftershock Jeff Vickers. So had to put that on there for him. And same backing, full leather. These are nice. These will hold up and last for a long time. So, real happy with how these turned out. I might do something else with this material. Um, I'll probably do a how-to video on how I do some of these from pattern all the way up. Uh, the letters and everything I did cut out on my Cricut uh, this time just to save a little time and get some more clean edges. I do them with a razor blade sometimes. Um, but this material is thin enough to where I can cut it out on that and it does a really good job and it's faster and then I can save the pattern in my um, software and not have to worry about it so which I mean you see the difference this one I cut out on a machine this one I drew out after I cut this out and traced it I traced this one onto the back of this and then cut it out by hand so you can't even tell the difference really it's the same thing so these are about a four and a half inch length and then he's got big wrists so they're like 12 inches around they're pretty good size leather lace runners these are about a uh, three quarters of an inch wide so yeah i'm gonna put black laces in them for him and they're ready to go